everybody, welcome to the world of Micah. Today I'm here at Epcot Center taking a closer look at a few things. There's a lot of things that still exist at Epcot Center from back in the day. Now back when Epcot Center first opened up in 1982, this place was the future. This place was so futuristic. I mean, everything about it was the future. And I thought this was legitimately the future. When I came here as a child, I thought for some reason we time traveled and we were living in the future. Today's futuristic remnants of the past have been picked at random and they are in no order, nor do they represent a certain time frame in Epcot Center history. I've simply picked these out of random and feel like having fun finding each of these items. So let's take a closer look at some futuristic remnants of the past. So when Epcot Center first opened in 1982, there were these symbols that Epcot Center used for pretty much every attraction in the future world. And they were really carefully thought out symbols. And it was pretty interesting how they used it for so many years. And now these things are almost a remnant of the past. It still exists in very different areas of future world and they're almost hidden now. And they do not use those symbols as strictly the main branding for the attraction anymore. They're almost just like a little tiny nod to the past. So let's journey around Future World and see how many of those original symbols we can find that still exist here in Future World. Okay. Let's see if we can find the Living Seas emblem. <laughs> I wonder if clownfish taste funny. <laughs> the Living Seas. There it is, the Living Seas symbol. That is the Living Seas brand from 1986. That is awesome. So glad I found the Living Seas. That one I was a little worried about. Let's see if we can find the one inside the land. I'm not finding this one which is kind of a bummer. I'm gonna check one more spot. This was a fail. Let's take a journey inside this pavilion and see what we can find. Did not find the symbol inside. However, I did find the symbol and it's right over here at Figment's old meet and greet location. And there it is. This was the symbol that used to represent the whole pavilion. Right there. That is it. It's pretty crazy to see how all the wear and tear on this thing. This is the old Figment meet and greet location, so I'm not sure how long this will be here, what the future will hold for this building, or that symbol, but that is it. Right there. See if we can find at the universe of energy. It's the original logo and the universe of energy before it was Ellen's energy adventure. That's pretty cool. It still exists. That is so cool. The original Universe of Energy logo and the original Epcot symbol is still on the wall inside the attraction. Man. I thought that one was gonna be a, a flop. I didn't think it was gonna be in there, but it's still in there. That's pretty awesome. Now, if the rumors are true, don't know how much longer this is gonna be here. So if you wanna go get a picture and actually see something original Epcot, it's right there at the Universe of Energy. Let's move on and see what else we can find over here in Future World. This was once the home of Horizons. Sadly, it is no longer here, but I'm gonna see if I can find 
the original symbol from Horizons. Well, that was a fail. From this angle of the building, it almost looks exactly like it did when it was World of Motion. And I'm gonna go find the original World of Motion symbol that exists still right here at Test Track. Okay, so that one was pretty easy. That symbol is literally used all over this attraction, which makes me happy. So it wasn't really hard to find. All right, let's see if we can find that Spaceship Earth symbol. All right, that is not the original Spaceship Earth symbol, but that's what we have now. Weird. The original Epcot Center logo right there. This logo is also used quite frequently. Look at that guy. Pretty awesome. Old school Epcot. So thanks for watching and thanks for taking a closer look today at futuristic remnants of the past here at Epcot Center. I had a lot of fun today looking around at old things from the past and I hope you guys enjoyed it too. The next time you come here to Epcot Center and you feel like taking a trip back to 1982 leading up to the year 2016 look around you'd be surprised on how many things you can find that still exist here from way back in the day be sure to visit my website worldofmica.com and subscribe to this youtube channel youtube.com slash worldofmica for more videos be sure to also visit my web store worldofmica.spreadshirt.com thanks for taking a closer look guys stay weird goodbye